High, Jelani Brown, Kingston College, Jaden Brown, Magati High, Corey Christie, St. Jago, Philip Palmer of St. Jago as well, and Kirk Lander Reed of St. Elizabeth Technical. All right, so they're sent off for the final of the class uh, three boys, uh, 1500 meters, and uh, jumping out early. That looks to be the athlete from uh, St. Jago, and uh, maybe Corey uh, Christie is, uh, was decided to go out uh, early. And uh, trying to go with him, the athlete from Magati High, Jaden Brown, number four this season on the national list, Brown. And they're all closely bunched. Eden Allen's Moses Johnson on the outside there, number two this season. They expected to challenge for a medal. And uh, King, the uh, Kingston College's uh, Christopher Anderson is also right, right there. And that's uh, Magati's Brown who comes into your picture now. But deciding to uh, take out uh, the early pace, that's uh, Moses Johnson of Edwin Allen. And looking to live up to the performances set years ago by the likes of uh, Edwin, uh, rather Aldwin Sappleton, outstanding middle distance runner in class three for Edwin Allen in those years before uh, heading to Monroe. But this is uh, Moses Johnson. And going with him is Jelani Brown, rather Jaden Brown of Magati. Colabar's uh, Carlos Bryson Keynes, the season leader, left back in third at the moment. But uh, really pressing early is Moses Johnson. And you wonder, diminutively built, you wonder if he may pay the price a bit later on for going out a bit hard. But uh, staying right there with him on his heels, Jaden Brown of Magati High. Bryson Keynes of Color Bar right there. And then the rest of the pack. So. Two laps to go. Two laps to go. Johnson of Edwin Allen continues to lead. And uh, if this is uh, his strategy, uh, working for the time being, as uh, he and uh, Brown, as well as uh, Keynes out of Color Bar, have really separated themselves from the pack. Right. When you look at uh, Bryson Keynes there of Color Bar, looks as if he's just biding his time, Bryson Keynes. Rather, yeah, Bryson Keynes of Color Bar, the season leader. And Moses Johnson took it out hard. Brown of Magati, right on his heels still. But it's uh, the medals for the time being. Uh, looks to be amongst these three. Here comes Bryson Keynes. Now, I did say he looked... Uh, really comfortable back there in third place and J Moses Johnson of Eden Island responds but looking supremely easy is uh, Bryson Keynes of uh, Color Bar and all season running well did well at the corporate championships as well Bryson Keynes 4.14.87 his uh, PB coming into champs this year and he has that lead at the bell lap and John Brown of Magati is staying right there uh, with him. So it's the corporate champion being trailed by the Western champion. And a bit back is uh, the central champion in Moses Johnson. So it's coming down to these two down the back stretch. And uh, Bryson Keynes of Calabar opening up a slight lead now on Brown of Magati High. Brown, can he respond with the 200 meters to go? And he is doing so, is Brown of Magati. But I tell you what, Keynes has looked comfortable all the way through. And he looks as if he has a bit more left in the tank. But can he hold off Jaden Brown, who has uh, been lying in second place uh, the entire race and comes up onto the shoulders now of uh, Bryson Keynes. So it's Jaden Brown of Magati. Keynes responds. Brown presses. Keynes responds. And to the line is... The corporate champion in uh, Keynes. Can he hold off Brown of Magati? And he does so. What a run. And well back in third is Moses Johnson. But he'll have to be careful as he's been tracked by the KC and uh, uh, Jamaica College pair. And they go flying past him for that third spot. And Moses Johnson, after running, taking uh, the lead early and really pressing and i did say would he pay the price and he did in the end but your winner there the bespectacled 
Carlos Bryson Keynes of Calabar showing just why he is uh, uh, the, the, was considered the gold medal favorite as we look back at the replay, gentlemen. Yes, we actually had two races being run at the same time. <laughs> we had that race between the two, uh, the two champions, um, Brown from uh, Magotti and Bryce Keynes. Uh, in this, this race, the better form prevailed to the end because Bryce Keynes was more, more upright, sprinting to the line, and Brown was leading forward somewhat. But we must also congratulate um, the young man, Moses Johnson, from Edwin Allen, who took out the pace and had and separated himself with the other two champion, uh, corporate and, and um, central champions, champions from, from, from the rest of the field. And as you look at the replay, Bryce Keynes holding his, his form, much more upright than Brown. With, with Brown leaning uh, forward just a little bit. But great race by both young men. And the next part of the race, we had the young man from Kingston College and the other from Jamaica College racing to the line. Yeah. And the young man from Jamaica College who was... Um, that was Christopher Carty, Anderson and Carty. Yeah. Grace Kennedy Boys and Girls Championships. Exclusively on TVJ, TVJSN and OneSpotMedia.com.